Okay, this is the January 2011 BY1 paper. Uh, we're looking at question number one. Uh, and always, uh, the, the first question uh, should be pretty straightforward for everyone. Uh, this is uh, another example of the examiner using a table here. Um, this one is all about um, uh, various inorganic ions. Okay, now the functions of those ions can be found in the general chemistry notes uh, within the app. Okay, so uh, you should be getting uh, full marks on this. Uh, there's no excuse not to get full marks on this. Okay, uh, magnesium then, uh, it's a component of chlorophyll. Um, iron, okay, uh, is a component of hemoglobin. It forms the heme part of, uh, of the protein. Uh, phosphate, uh, a number of functions of phosphate. Um, it's uh, a component of nucleic acids, of course. Um, it's actually found in ATP. ATP stands for adenosine triphosphate. Okay. Um, of course, phosphate is found in phospholipids as well. Okay, so it's a component of phospholipids. Uh, and, of course, it's found in bone. It, uh, it can help harden bone. Um, lastly then, calcium, okay, uh, again, this is found in, in bone as well as teeth, okay, and it can harden harden bone, okay. Um, calcium as well is actually used in um, synaptic transmission, I don't know whether people uh, would know that uh, in, in the AS level, um, but that's something you will do in your second year work. Okay, so I've, uh, I've I've typed in some answers there. Um, uh, magnesium, then component of chlorophyll. Iron, a component of hemoglobin. For the phosphate, I've decided to go for the uh, component of DNA, but as I've said previously, other uh, functions of phosphate. And calcium, I've gone for uh, hardens uh, bone. Okay, uh, straightforward question. All should get four uh, full marks on that one.